All right, so clearly I'm not inside doing this Fio Pasión Friday video, but it is Friday, or at any time at this moment you're watching this video, I'm excited because there's a saying that says knowledge is power, but I think we can maybe hopefully agree that it's not so much about power, but it, knowledge is access. And that's just something that I've been pondering on uh, lately. So hopefully you guys can enjoy this little quick snippet of really understanding that we all got to be determined. And if we're determined, I think we're going to succeed. So uh, ladies and gentlemen, let's go. Hola, ¿qué tal, mi gente? This is Noan El Boricua, and I'm really excited. Um, I never really have done an outside video. I think this is my first one, if I'm correct. It's been quite a few, but we're close to 100 episodes here on Instagram. I don't know what it looks like on YouTube, which, by the way, if you do enjoy this video at any point, yo, hit a like, uh, subscribe. We're trying to get that algorithm up the channel via YouTube. And if you're listening to us via podcast, muchas gracias, thank you. There is a sound in the background, and it is the water fountain. I don't know if you can tell, but it's in the backdrop. I don't know, if, I think I blew it out just cause I don't know if my ISO is good. Um, I'm still rookie and learning in the game. All right, really quick, I wanted to share this. I had an opportunity to be able to listen to some really powerful moments in this week, a couple podcasts, a couple different episodes, but more importantly, even some people that I've met. And I think one of the biggest things that I've learned is that when we think about our people and we think about movimiento, movement, um, specifically like in our colored communities and just people that don't have access in certain communities I think about like knowledge is the opportunity where it gives us the access and the know-how to be able to go forward and I think one of the biggest things that we need to understand is the following and I and I kind of wrote this down that a lot of times we want to give up on the journey and that we're not willing to endure what's coming at us and I think that the more that we get to learn read listen engage with others allows you to really understand the importance of what we like to talk about here at the podcast is cultura how do you immerse yourself in it through you know the music the arts business what is that cultura that you're into and also for a lot of my people that you know you have your faith and that's the faith that grounds you that gives you the hope to go forward and maybe it's the conexión is like we out here networking how do we make those connections how do we grow the network of the people that we have so one of the things that kind of I was thinking about this was, I don't want you to give up. I don't want you to give up in the fight. A lot of times, a lot of people give up in the fight. The ones that are not willing to finish the race, the ones that are not willing to really go all out, are the ones that will never receive the reward. And that's why knowledge is the axis. I, I hope that you can understand as I've been kind of reflecting and really just kind of thinking about next steps and and something that I'm looking at in the year of 2023, because this is a month of gratitude, even though every day is a month of gratitude. This month is special, right? We think about our family, our friends, our community, and we're thankful. And I hope that if you've been struggling throughout this year, maybe there's been peaks and valleys. That's all right. That's the point of fighting the good fight. It's the point of letting us to be determined. And I think, I hope one of the unlocks, when I think about knowledge, as an athlete, I'm gonna keep it 100. Shout out to my boy Wade. We were I'm supposed to do 100 push-ups every day for the month of November. I did 100 on November 1st. I did 12 on the second, and then I tried to do seven later on. I I failed, so I only did 13 on the second day. And November 3rd, I only did three. I think I injured my tricep. Uh, don't ever. I haven't done push-ups in almost a year and a half, and I decided to go all out versus doing it in increments increments I don't even know if I said that right wow I I'm it's been a long week anyhow I think the knowledge that I've understood and and really the unlock is understanding endurance now this is what I have endurance is not passive like it's not a passive affair it takes a lot of strength to be able to hang on and stay standing when everything underneath us could be shifting and moving and maybe doing things that it shouldn't be doing. But here's the thing where I talk about not just cultura and conexiones, but when I think about even just faith, right? It's really understanding that we are not alone. And I hope that you guys understand that. You know, you can have your loved ones, you can have family, you can have God. I hope you don't feel that you're alone. I hope that you understand that 
the endurance allows you to always remember that there's something there that keeps making you go forward. And I hope, uh, and I think it's crazy because as I'm reading this, I think no matter what we encounter in the world, I hope you're mindful and faithful to God and family and your loved ones. And more importantly, that you're determined. Endurance will get you there. The knowledge that you gain will give you the access to be able to get to the next level. So no matter if this is in the workplace, or if this is just for you educationally, or whatever that looks like for you, my hope is that you understand the importance of knowing and seeking it. Pero más importante, more importantly, uh, understanding the importance of endurance. That's what I got for y'all. Um, I don't even know what time I'm at. But anyways, check us out. Fiopasionpodcast.com And thank you guys for uh, following us on the audio podcast. We've now hit 2.3 thousand downloads. I want to say thank you so much for that. And uh, remember, immerse yourself dentro de la cultura. Always grow in your faith. Y como siempre, make those conexiones. Y como dice mi abuelita, que Dios te bendiga.